It's a chilly 50 degrees this morning. Dropped about 20 degrees overnight. We're here in Rice Lake, Wisconsin. We're gonna fish the lake that gave the city its name, Rice Lake. And not to be confused with uh, the other Rice Lakes, there's a lot of them around here. This one's in Barron County, right in the town of Rice Lake. I'll show it on the map here right after this so you know exactly which lake it is. We're at the uh, Veterans Memorial Landing. Yeah, it's a Veterans Memorial Park. And uh, they got a pretty decent uh, parking lot here. I have noticed the slots for the boats parking though, it's, uh, they're kind of short, so I'm sticking out a little ways. And I have an 18 foot boat. Um, they got a nice pavilion, you see that right behind me? They have really nice bathrooms over there. And um, fishing pier, pretty nice fishing pier if you wanna fish there. Having like in a little bay here. Might be some good bluegills and stuff as we start off the landing. But uh, it's kind of a long skinny lake. We're gonna go out and explore it all. So I'd like to invite you along. Come out and explore this lake with me and see what it has to offer. My name's Randy, you're watching Go Midwest Fishing, helping you catch more fish than the other guys. Right, we're going to start off right by the landing. They got some lily pads behind us. Looks like a nice spot for some bass. This lake has just about anything you could want to fish for in it. So we'll try it for a little bit of everything. See what we catch today. Weeds following it. Is there something following? <laughs> we spent chopping some weeds. Also, I saw a bunch of crap come on in the boat. Get shallow pretty quick. Oh, I had a little. Oh, you had one? Had a little northern on there. Sweet. At least we had something. Tiny little guy. Yeah. Let's see if we can't lure him back in. Yeah, I don't know if this drop of temperature has turned the fish off a little bit, but it got kind of a strong little breeze blowing. So we're going to cruise all the way up to the other end of the lake and then just kind of use the wind to drift back through. So. Uh, I'll take that drive now. Wow, I guess I've never been over here since they fixed the beach. I've up. never seen that. That's all. It's fairly new. Yeah. Cool. We just went under that bridge that goes by the Narrows Park. Pretty nice park up there if you ever want to come and have a picnic or anything, it's a good spot to do it. Now we're on the, the bigger part of the lake, so we're going to just zoom up to the far end and take a little drive. We are on the far north end. If you go, there's a bridge right there. If you go under that, you go into Stump Lake. Uh, what are we at here? About nine feet deep. And there's a couple boats out here throwing some musky lures. So I think we're gonna maybe put on some bigger baits and join them. According to Sportsman's Guide, right where we're at says, uh, muskies can be found in the flats off the northern shore near the Stump Lake Inlet. All right, let's go take a look, see if there's any muskies under here. It's only seven feet deep. Let's see what it looks like. 
All right, we're recording. Here we go. Oh, there we go. You see my? No, but there's a. There's actually quite a few weeds down there. Bottom's pretty mushy. Yeah, a lot of a lot of algae down there and uh, kind of cloudy water. Oh, what's that? Sometimes I think I see fish, but it might be something else. Oh, what's no? That's a weed. Caught up on some weeds. All right, pull it out of the weeds. Yeah, that, that one got stuck. Look at that. <laughs> You like my little homemade fin there I made? Helps keep the camera a little straighter and doesn't wobble as much. So far it's working pretty good. All right, let's go back down. There we go. Cruising along. Moving along at about one mile an hour here, just seeing what's down there. Ooh. Yep, just kind of cloudy water with a bunch of weeds at the bottom. All right, let's go throw some musky lures in there, see what we can do. This might be a spot to throw out the robotic lure. Muskies hanging around. I think I'm going to try it. Cooler to see on a clear water so you could actually kind of see it. <laughs> All right, we are going to try out the robotic lure. We're in a spot here where it's supposed to be a lot of muskies. So we're going to let it dangle over and uh, hopefully lure in the muskies and then they can hit this thing when they get close. Swimming. Yeah, there it goes. A little crazy. I don't know if this this lure I may have to be in, like sitting still more. Probably. It doesn't like to be pulled along, I don't think. Alright, we're just cruised down to about the center of the lake. Kinda gets a little shallower. There's some uh, buoys, red and uh, green buoys that kinda go through the middle of it because it is a little bit shallower, but we're off to the side here. Um, there's like a little bay, tall reeds and stuff. We're gonna work that and then maybe cut across to there's a kind of little river inlet. There's a go in or out there. Anyway, we'll go try that after this spot. Kind of just work this middle area where it's, uh, you know, it's, right now we're at nine feet, but it goes about five, six feet with some nice tall weeds in there. Might be some big northern muskie just swimming around. We'll try that. Oh, did you see that one? No. It just like darted across my line, but it made a big old wake all the way across the top. That's weeds. You know, the fish, they, they usually like it where we we'll don't, so they're probably out in the windy, nasty parts of the lake. Yeah. Seeing all kinds of little fish jumping out there. But they're just little bait fish, nothing to really catch. So I don't know, maybe we'll go over and try out the deeper water. Right in that little inlet there. Try to go over in the river part. Kind of like this spot. I'm going to just anchor here for a second. Nice, a little bit deeper, still got some weeds. Right, we just talked to the other guy that was musky fishing out here and he said uh, he had a couple follows but didn't catch any fish yet. So we're just going to go up through these buoys here and troll. I got uh, a little 360 search bait on. Try that out because there's some weeds in here I don't want to get caught up. So we'll try that. And uh, I got the camera on it so you'll be able to see <laughs> when I get home. Uh, probably you'll get to see right away but I won't see until I get home what the heck we saw under here.
right now we're right by the the dam it goes right uh, Main Street and Rice Lake there goes right over the top of it but there's a boat launch right next to it so first you got the bridge here then you got the dam and then right next to this bridge here looks like is that just a footbridge yeah, yeah just a footbridge uh, nice little landing here it's got uh, two docks two slots you can uh, put boats in and looks like a fairly big uh, parking lot up there it's another good option if you want to park oh yeah Right there, you got a little park you can hang out on. A little log building there and stuff. And uh, Reggie was here before, and they, uh, his little girl caught a nice bass right here. Oh, there's a bite! Oh, look at him! Oh, there he goes! One. Oh, you got one? Smallmouth? No, it was a northern. Northern? Oh, almost had one. <laughs> oh, yeah, I've seen it. <laughs> See if we can't go out there and get him again. Yeah, it was a smaller northern, but it was a fish. Well, that's what I had the little bite on, was the green spin. It was it. Yeah. So that Reggie had that northern hit at the beginning, and it was the same bait this one is. So, as usual, we always end up fishing with this thing. <laughs> <Yep>. <laughs> <laughs> Just as you were leaving, huh? <laughs> it doesn't feel too big. Oh, where'd it go? Oh, oh come on. You just caught a weed. You no, it was a fish. fish. Whatever. <laughs> it was totally a fish. <laughs> ah, he traded me for a weed, but it was. <laughs> no doubt about that one. It was a fish. Well, I wish I had more fish to show you today, but uh, I think that cold weather that came in last night just turned all the fish off. Although we did have a couple northern strike, and when we talked that boat out there, you had some musky follows. We didn't have any bites either. Couldn't get the panfish to bite. That's uh, usually a gimme. You can usually catch those anywhere. Um, if you do want to fish Rice Lake, I will put a lake review up on GoMidwestFishing.com and I'll kind of pinpoint out all the hot spots that uh, you might want to try if you're up here. In the meantime, try out these other lakes that are in the nearby area. Yeah.